Hello, hello to everyone. Hello, can you hear me? Okay, welcome to another English class. This is the class number a nine. Nine, if I'm not wrong. Yeah, nine. Okay, today it is Thursday, 26. 26. Okay, so please get ready. We're going to start the class. All right, in the previous class, we studied the use of enough. Also, we had the reading. And yesterday, we had the... We have the vocabulary practice, the vocabulary practice. For example, does anybody remember what product design is? What is product design? Is to create a new product to be sold by a business with customers. What is product design? Does anybody remember? Product design is to create a I'm sorry, new product. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. The audio doesn't work. Hello, hello, hello. Can you hear me now? I'm sorry, but the, the audio didn't work well. Hello, can you hear me? Hello. Okay, yes, now I can, I can hear, you. hear you. Now I can hear you. I'm sorry. Okay. okay. Don't worry. I thought I was talking alone, but then I realized the audience didn't wasn't working well. Okay, here we go. Um, okay, product, product design. Product design. What does product design mean? To create, to create a new product to be sold by a business to its customer. I'm sorry. To create a new product to be sold by a business to its customer. Excellent. All right. How about after sales service? After sales service. After sales service. What does it mean? The help and information that is provided to customers after they have bought a particular product. After they have bought, after have bought. they have bought a particular product. Very good. What is brand? What is brand? What is brand? Do you remember what brand is? What is brand? The use, the use, okay. the use. Of, a of a name, term, symbol, or design to give a product and you okay. identify in the marketplace. Excellent. The name, term, symbol, design to give a product unique identify in the market. Excellent. For example, Coca Cola has it's a brand, it has its own icon. All right. What are features? Features. What are features? What are features? Characteristics. Characteristics. Of a product that describes its appearance. Components it's... and... Okay. Components. Components, Components. and... Components. Capabilities. capabilities, capabilities, excellent. And product position, positioning, product positioning. In the process of creating an image okay. of a product in the minds of the consumers. Excellent, very good. Thank you very much for your participation. Okay, very good. Here we have product design, after self service, we have brand, we have features, we have product positioning. Very good. And thank you very much for your participation. Okay. Well, well, 
okay, now we have another conversation. And it says, Sofia is discussing some ideas about the place to distribute her product. Read the conversation and make turns practicing it. I would like, I would like to sell training courses online. I have developed a few, but I'm not sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. What do you mean by access? You could sell your training courses online. People are always using their phones to sort the web and learn new things. This is great because you can create awareness about your product from social networking sites and create enough interest, interest in the courses so that people will buy them. Okay, it's quite long, but it's good. I like this conversation. Okay. Uh, all right. Well, we're going to practice the conversation. Okay. I don't know if you have any question. If you have any question related with the vocabulary or pronunciation. I have a question. Uh, what is the meaning of Mama. awareness? Mama. I don't know. Awareness. Oh, how do you pronounce? Awareness. Mama. What it is? Awareness. Like aware. Aware. Okay. It is like conciencia. Estar consciente. Estar sa saber que existe algo. Awareness. Aware. Awareness. Okay. Thank you. Estar consciente, eh, que se note. No sé cómo explicarlo literalmente. Pero aware, to be aware. Estar Como consciente. Estar alerta, okay. estar alerta. Uh -huh. Okay. Is it clear, okay. the synonyms? Oh, well. Yes, it is. All right, thank you. Thank you. Any other volunteer? Okay, is there another question? How about develop? Do you remember what develop is? Develop. Desarrollo. Desarrollo, okay. El verbo es desarrollar y desarrollo. El sustantivo sería development. Okay, ah, this is a tricky word. Do you remember the meaning of this? Actually. En realidad. Actually. En realidad, muy bien. En realidad. No es actualmente, sino que es realmente. Okay, very good. Okay, here we have this word. It Sometimes you... Ah, by the way. ¿Cómo se escucha mi audio? ¿Se escucha claro y fuerte o se escucha como alejado? Claro y fuerte. Muy bien, thank you. Se oye bien, teacher, claro thank y you. fuerte. Thank you very much for your feedback. 
Okay, advantage. This word can be pronounced uh, either advantage or advantage. Advantage too. But I prefer to say advantage. Okay, advantage. Okay, uh, what do you mean? Do you, what do you mean? ¿Qué quiere decir? ¿O cuál es el significado? What do you mean by that? What do you mean by that? ¿Qué significa? ¿O qué quiere decir con eso? What do you mean by access? ¿Qué es, quiere decir o qué significa el acceso? Okay, uh, let me see. Training courses online. People are always using their phone to surf, okay? Surf, en este caso, sería como navegar a través de la web. Estoy navegando. I'm surfing in, in internet. And learn new things. This is a great because you can create awareness. Como conciencia. O que existe about your product from social networking sites. And create enough interest in the courses so that people will buy them. All right, uh, we're going to practice this conversation. It's quite long, but we're going to try to practice. In case you have any question, please let me know. Okay, there we go.
Hi, teacher. Hi, miss. I'm sorry. I have to enter again. I don't know why. Me saca. <laughs> okay. There you go. There, there you will come up on like and a message. Teacher, okay. I have the same problem. Tell me. I have the same problem. Ah, okay. Let me see. Try now. The scientists and I don't know how to pronounce this. What palabra? Sites. Site. Sites. Okay, thanks, Mama. Networking site. Networking site. And cut and now interested in the goals so that people will buy them. Okay. Madam Manuel. ¿Quién me hace barro? Ay, vea, sí, yo. Sí, llámalo. Bueno. Eh, empiezo usted, empiezo yo. Dile. Bueno. I would like to sell training course eh, online. I have developed eh, a few. Um, but I am not sure if I should get a place like our story to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. What do you mean by access? You would sell your training courses online. People are always using their phone to surf the web and learn new and learn new thing. This is great because you can create awareness awareness no me acuerdo como dijo esa palabra uh, awarenesses awarenesses about your product from social networking site and create enough interest in the courses so that people Will by ten. Okay, muy bien, please. Are you like? The, are you like to sell training courses online? I have developed a few, but I am not sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. I think the place is actuality. Irrelevant, uh, you have to take advantage 
of access? What do you mean by access? You could uh, sell your training course online. People are always using their phones to search the web and learn new things. This is good because you can get awareness about your product from social networking sites and create a new interest in the courses that people will buy them. Okay. Uh, okay. I I would like to sell training courses. I would like to sell training courses online. I have developed develop um, develop a few, but I'm not sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. What do you mean by access? You course it through your training courses online. People are always using their phone to surf the web and learn new things. This, this is great because you can create awareness about your product from social networking sites and create enough interest in the courses so so sad so that people will buy them i would like to sell training courses online i have developed developed a few but i am not sure if I sure I, uh, I sure get a place like a store to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage to of access. What do you mean by access? You could sell your training courses online. People are always using their phones to surf the web and learn new things. This is great because you can create awareness about your product from social networking sites and create enough interest in the course so that people will buy them. ¿Cómo se dice? Cities. Cities. Site. Site. Sites. Site. 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 Con, con ese va. Site. Creo que sí. Site. Okay. De, de otra vez con, con sites. Okay. Si quieren seguimos practicando. Va a estar ya por este sitio. Igual.
<clears throat> I would like to start a training process on my. I have developed a few, but I am not sure if I, sh I should get a place like I start to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. What do you mean by access? <clears throat> you could share your training course online. People are always using their phones to surf the web and learn new things. This is great because you can create awareness about your product from social networking sites and create a no interest in the course so that people will use them. I would uh, like to oh dale carencita. Okay. I would like to sell training courses online. I have developed a few but I'm not sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. I think the place is, is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. What do you mean by access? You could sell your training courses online. People are always using their phones to surf the web and learn new things. This is great because you can create awareness about your product from social networking sites and create enough interest in the courses so that people will buy them. In by access. Uh, you could sit you train in the course online people are always who sit and they found the source the web and they learn new things. The easiest correct because you can read awareness about your product uh, from social networking and see and the great and know you know interested in the course in the so that people will buy things. Okay, now you are Sofia and I am Arnold. Um, yeah. I would like to see training course online. I have delivered a fit, a fit, but I am the course. I soon get a place like um, the store to set them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. What did you mean by access? You could sell your training courses online. People are always using their phones to surf the web and learn new things. This is great because you can create awareness about your product from social networking sites and create enough interest in the courses so that people will buy them. Now, <clears throat> now, seguimos practicando. Okay, no sé si nos pasamos a las preguntas. No hay okay. Digo yo. Mira, esta es la cosita, no la vas a cortar en la mañana. Ok. Mira, me encanta. ¿Quieres practicar otra vez? ¿Quieres practicar otra vez? ¿Quieres practicar otra vez? ¿Quieres practicar otra vez? Permítame que se me dé. Sí, gusta. Vale. Porque hay unas cosas que me cuestan pronunciarla. Unas palabras okay. quiero decir. Yo estoy. Ok, sigamos practicando. Ok. Yo estoy, Clarita. 
Well, um, to start in um, Sofia, yes, I would yes, Sophia. like to sit. Uh, to sell. To start, I would like to sit, sell, training, to course. Sell. course. Mm -hmm. To sell, perdón. To train, course, online. I have delivered. Dile I feel, but I am not sure uh, it and so so get a place like a store to sell thing. I think the play is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. Um, and what do you mean by access? You will sell your training course online. People are always using their phones to surf the web and learn new things. This is great because you can create awareness about your product from social networking sites and create enough interest in the course so that people will buy them. Now, I, I start. I would like to sell training courses online. I have developed a few, but I'm not sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. Okay, I think the place in the actuality is relevant. You have to take advantage of access. What do you mean by access? You go see to try me course. Online, people uh, are, are always using their platform to surf the web and they learn new things. This is a great because you can get a warrant set on to product from social networking in the city and create an innovation in the course so that people will buy things. Okay. Okay, Clarissa. Okay. No. Vamos nosotros. Bye, sorry. ¿Empiezas tú o empiezo yo? Um, si gusta, empiezo yo. Okay, okay. Okay. Let's start. I would like to sell training course online. I have to live on it as few, but I am not search on the store great and place size uh, store to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. What do you mean by access? You can sell your training courses online. People are always using their phones Okay, well, uh, now that you practice the conversation, okay, now it's time to read it. Okay, this time I'm going to be Sophia and you are or Arnold. Okay, remember, I'm going to I'm going to read Sophia's paragraph and you have to and you have to read Arnold's paragraph. Mama. Let's start. I would like to sell training courses online. I have developed a few, but I'm not sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. I think the I place, think the place is actually relevant. You have to take a What do you mean by access? You could sell you your, sell sell your training, training courses online. online. People are always, always using their phones to solve the work and learn new things. This is great because you can create awareness about each other from social networking sites 
encourage uh, no interest, interest in, in, the in the courses, courses of that, that people will buy, buy them. Excellent. Now you are Sofia and I am Arno. Let's start. I would like to I think the place is actually relevant. You have to take advantage of access. What do you, what do you mean by access? Uh, you could sell your training course online. People are always using their phones to surf the web and learn new things. This is this is great because you can create awareness about your product from social networking sites and create enough interest in the courses so that people will buy them. Okay, now uh, I need a volunteer for Sofia and another for Arnold. Who wants to be Sofia? Me, teacher, Sandra. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Miss Sandra. You are Sofia and I need one for Arnold. Me, teacher. Thank you, Miss Rosibel. All right, let's start. Ready? Three, two, one, action. I would like to sell training courses online. I have developed a few, but I am not sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take an advantage of access. What do you mean by access? You could sell your training courses online. People are always using their phones to surf the web and learn new things. This is great because you can create awareness about your product from social networking sites and create enough interest in the courses so that people will buy them. Okay, awareness, awareness. 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 Okay, awareness. buy them, buy them. Buy them. Buy them. Buy them. Buy them. Buy them. Okay, social networking. Social networking. Social networking. Social networking. Training courses. Training, Training courses. Training courses. Training okay, courses. good. Well, uh, I need another volunteer for Sophia. Me, teacher. Thank you, Miss Karen. And one for Arnold. Me, teacher. Okay, thank you, mister. Let's start. Three, two, one, action. I would like to sell training courses online. I have developed a few, but I am sh not sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. What do you mean by access? You will sell through training courses online. People are always using their phones to surf the web and learn new things. This is great because you can create awareness, awareness about your product from social networking sites and create enough interest in the courses so, so that people will buy them. Excellent. Very good. Okay. Uh, awareness. Awar awareness. 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 Okay. Very good. Uh, cool sell. You could sell. You could. Sin la L. You could sell. You could sell. You could sell. Excellent. Okay. And this one is I would like. I, I would, would like. Okay, could and would. Okay. okay could teacher. and could. Excellent. Advantage. 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 Very good. Okay. Uh, another couple, another pair. I'm sorry. Sophia. 
one for Sofia. Me teacher. Thank you, Mr. Guillermo, and one for Arnold. Me teacher. Excellent. Thank you, Miss. Let's start. Okay. Three, two, one. Like, action. I would like to sell training courses online. I have developed a few, but I'm not sure if. I should get a place like a store to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage of access. What do you mean by access? Mm -hmm. You could sell your training courses online. People are always using their phones to surf the web and learn new things. This is great because you can create awareness about your product from social networking sites and create enough interest in the course in the courses so that people will buy them. Okay. Very good. Excellent pronunciation. And the last pair, la última. One for Sofia. Me teacher. Thank you, Miss Cristina and Arnold. Me, teacher. Thank you very much. All right, let's get started. Three, two, one, action. I would like to sell training courses online. I have developed a few, but I'm not sure if I should get a place like a store to sell them. I think the place is actually irrelevant. You have to take advantage advantage of access. What do you mean by access? You could set your training courses online. People are always using their phones to surf the web and learn new things. This is great because you can create awareness about your product from social networking sites and create enough interest in the courses so that people will buy them. Excellent. Good pronunciation. Very good. Thank you very much. Okay. Very good. Now let's get started. All right. Hey, what does Sofia want to sell? Courses. Training courses online. Training courses. Training courses online. Excellent. What? Okay. Seria, she wants. Vamos a contestar completo. Respuesta completa. She wants. She wants. She wants. Training courses. Training courses. Okay, very good. What isn't the What isn't she sure about? What isn't she sure about? The place. The place what? What happened with the place? To rent a place. To rent a place. Okay. Excellent. She is not sure or she isn't sure. Continue. She isn't. She isn't sure about to rent a place. Very good. Excellent. Much better. What are Arnold's recommendations? Take uh, the rec Arnold recommend mm -hmm. to recommended or recommends recommends uh, to make awareness aw awareness awareness uh, okay. on, so on social media and then the people can buy the courses. Courses, courses or courses, teacher? Courses. Courses. Excellent. Very good. Excellent. Okay. Enough information. Enough product. Okay. In the previous class, we studied the use of adjective plus enough. Now, uh, let's study the use of 
uh, enough plus noun. Okay, for example, look at the example, look for the, for instance, look at the examples in the box, then complete the exercise below. Enough is a word that can qualify an adverb or an adjective. It also be used but for a noun. Do you remember what a noun is? Do you remember, do you remember what a noun is? Okay, a noun can be a place, a person, a thought, um, thing, food, fruit, etc. So, uh, since we practiced this, the previous class, now we're going to complete the exercise one until exercise five.
Hi, teacher. Hi, did you finish the exercise? Uh, we was about not near to finish, but my, our partner or classmate uh, have issues, has issue, had issues with his connection. All right. Okay. Who was your partner, Manuel? Yes, teacher. Okay, he's coming. Thank you. Let's create. Create. Enough interest. Ay, que si la tengo me sale mala. Es que vea cómo cuesta. En la, en la tres íbamos. Eh, sí. Sí, en la tres. The place is surgery. Demands enough. Enough. Channels. Channels. Of distribution. ¿Cuál le sale mal a Concepción? La cuatro. Pero es created. Es, con, es, es en pasado el verbo. Mm. Created enough interest. In. Oh no, interest. So la D me falta entonces. Ajá, la D. No, pero ni aún así. No, pero en la do, la de la dos. No, la, eh, eh, la que en empieza. La tarea. Created. En la, en la, en la... Es que supuestamente solo se le iba a poner eso, eso nomás. Y el puntito. Ajá. Create bueno, con, con D, así como la dijo. Enough. Enough. Y yo no le he puesto ni punto nada y solo, solo he puesto las muy tres palabras. Create enough interns. Ah, entonces sin, sin el de Mark. De Mark Ajá, sin nada de eso. Y así sí me lo, me lo tomó como bueno. En la parte esa, porque en la parte del midterm, ahí sí no me lo agarró así. Ah, vale, a mí también. Ahorita ya me salió buena. Solo con las tres. <risa> y en esta, volviendo al ejercicio, sería Retailer's Wheel. ¿En cuál vamos? En la cuatro. En la cuatro. Ok. Stock enough. Stock enough. Ajá. Uh -huh. Wools and sell them. Sell them. Uh -huh. Y la cinco sería we lack enough information on the competition. Ajá, uh -huh. we lack enough information. This one, okay. This is the only the others I don't have. Uh, the marketing department has them. Teacher, I I can do these sentences. Hello teacher. <laughs> Hello teacher. No. He's coming in and go. 
Oh, slowly uh, is the one I can do. I don't know why. I I write in the two forms, and the two forms are bad. Thank you, Dani. Thank you, Sandrita. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. This Thank you. is in the platform in the homework 2.11 in the second part. Thank you. I only the number one. I don't know why. I changed the the font and I can do. Yeah. Information uh, on the competition. On the competition. 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 Okay. Así, ¿verdad? Yes. ¿Qué hizo? Eh, solo exercise five que vamos a hacer. Yes. Okay. Solo que en la en la plataforma la dona la va a agarrar esa palabra, ¿no? ¿Cuál? La dos. Offers. No. Y ahí era offer, offer o no. offers con S. Es offer. Sí, la S, ¿verdad? Sí. Ok, bye. Ahí está. Y qué tendríamos que poner en la dos entonces. Manuel. Hola. ¿Qué tendríamos que poner en la dos? O solo eh, la en vez de no, poner enough, no, les va, no les va a aceptar la palabra enough. Hay que okay. poner la palabra great. 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 Offer great. Okay. Okay. Great. Correct. Correct. ¿Qué significa? Great. Uh huh. Great is okay. Great is like grandes, grandiosas. Excelente. Okay. ok, thanks. Finish. Creo que ya estuvo todo. Sí. Yes. Vamos a hacer más el cuadrito. Ah, Mientras no nos saca del. Number six. Ok. No. Albert. Albertison. 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 Es como advertencia, ¿verdad? Publicidad. No. Ajá. Uh -huh. Advertising is like publicidad. Publicidad. Uh, I think it's the quiero ver. The fourth uh, sentence. A form of marketing that employs an openly sponsored message 
to promote or sell a product. Okay. Is Juan, verdad? Yes. yes. I think so. Are you agree? Yes. Yes. Okay. Personal sales. I think it's the last one. The last one. A person organization that provides funds. No, 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 no. That is a sponsor. A person organization oh, that provides yeah. funds. That's a sponsor. Yeah, you're right. Mm -hmm. Number two. No, that one is four. That's number four. Or? Yes. yes. I think the sales interaction. Sales interaction. Yeah. Between mm -hmm. the parents' representative and a customer. Yes, and that, that one is. To one yes. Yeah. Number two. Two. Okay. Uh, uh, sales promotion, I think is the first one and five is the second. Yes, sales promotion is promotions designed to create a short terms increasing sales. Number three, yeah. yeah. And the last one is number five. Okay, we finish. Good job, team. Good job. Me gusta usar los emojis de aquí. No sé si se ve cuando lo uso. Yes. ¿Ustedes van al día en la plataforma? No, ya ni siquiera he entrado. Ay, es que yo hice dos días de esto. Y yo dije, no puede ser. Yo creo que soy la, la única que no ha he hecho nada. Dije. Eh, no. Ok, ya somos dos entonces. Ay, lo peor que este fin de semana. Bueno, mañana voy a hacer voluntariado. Oh. Eh, no el, el sábado tengo evento y después del evento sigo con el voluntariado. Ay, no. Yo creo que el fin de semana sí voy a, a poder avanzar. Okay. Y, y, y el otro fin de semana también tengo evento. <risas> ¿De qué evento? ¿Qué haces? Este, nosotros, bueno, va, nosotros eh, vamos a hacer una feria de empleo en Santa Ana. Ah. Ajá. Bueno, bueno. Entonces, estaba aquí, tenemos que ir, vea. Y mañana, mañana, no, el sábado, tengo que ir a una feria de empleo. Yo no soy de, de recursos humanos, soy comunicadora. Pero wow. ajá, eh, nos han invitado a una feria de empleos y tengo que ir a representar el proyecto que se llama como el de, el de, el de mi fotito. Bien, entonces, ajá, entonces ajá, nos han invitado y tengo que ir a dar información del proyecto. 
Ah, qué bueno. Ajá. Y como mañana y el sábado es el evento Teletón, voy a estar de voluntaria ayudando. Ay, es cierto, este fin de semana yo. Sí. Bueno, si hay alguno que no sepa cómo se hizo, hay que preguntar. Hello. Ok. All right. Okay, well, let's start. Uh, number one says the marketing department hasn't. What is the answer? Number one. Enough. Create en enough interest. Create enough interest. Hasn't create enough interest. Okay. Interest. Interest. I'm sorry. Hasn't create enough interest. All right. In the platform that our, uh, a student was telling me, telling me that I guess number two it is wrong. Okay, I'm going to report. I'm going to tell the people who is in charge of the platform. All right, number two, our products. Our products offer great features and benefits. I'm sorry. Our products offer mm -hmm. great feature and benefits. Excellent. Offer great feature and benefits. Okay. Uh, number three, the place strategy. Demand enough channels of distribution. All right, excellent. Retails will. The place, the retailers will. Retail will stock enough wood and sell them. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Them. Sorry, sorry. Can you can you read it again? Retail will stock enough goods and sell them. Excellent, very good. And the number five, we we lack enough information of the competition. I'm sorry, I can't hear you very well. No, the last one, five. We Sandra, I'm sorry. Your call. Okay. We lack enough information on the competition. Excellent. Thank you very much for your help. Now, people, well, we have studied the, the, the use of enough. And today, I would like to review a topic that is very famous among you which is the present simple or the present perfect. Okay, I would like to review this is this structure, which is very important. Let me know if you can see my presentation, please. Can you see yes, it? Sure. All right, the present perfect or the present perfect. Okay, something that is very important to clarify, it is that present perfect is totally different when you say the past participle. The past participle, it is the a structure or the tense of the verb. In present perfect, it is a grammatical structure. For example, past participle of the verb, you can use it in different tenses. For example, you can use it in present perfect, past perfect, passive voice, and many other. Okay, the past participle is the verb, the verb. 
in which is conjugated. And the present perfect is the tense. For example, the present perfect simple, because we have present perfect continuous, talks about action started in the past, but the action continues. One more time, the present perfect, it is an action that started in the past, but the action continues. For example, you can say, I have read a book many times. That means that you began the action maybe yesterday or two months ago. The present perfect is composed uh, by the following form. For example, you have to use either have or has plus the past participle of the verb. Some verb, uh, you have to add ed. And some other verbs, they, they change at all. For example, go, went, gone. See, saw, seen. Uh, play, played. Eat, ate, eaten. Etc. Okay. There are two elements. Uh, when do we use have? Do you remember when we use have? Have has to do with the subject. When do we use have? With I. We use a uh, third person. Mm, have. Third person. Have third person is I, called has. I, 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 you, we, they. I, you. Exactly. When we use I, you, we, they, we use have. When we use third person singular, as Mr. Manuel said, for example, he, she, or it, we're going to use she, it has. Has. Okay. And the verb must be in past participle. The past participle we studied yesterday. The present perfect affirmative. For example, I have cleaned the window. I have cleaned the window. The windows were dirty, but they are clean now. She has eaten her soup. She was hungry, but when she had her soup, she isn't hungry now. Remember, the present perfect is an action that began in the past. Okay, present perfect. Now, how is the negative form? Remember, we use hasn't or haven't, either hasn't or haven't. For example, he hasn't made his bed. He hasn't made his bed. We haven't drunk coffee. He got up, but his bed isn't tired. We're still sleepy because, because we drank no coffee. We haven't. Okay, the present perfect question form. With the question form, we need to switch out the position of the auxiliary has or have. For example, has he done his homework? Have you read the book? Has he, has he done his homework? Have you read the book? Present perfect. The present perfect. There are three words you can use in present perfect. For example, we can use already. Just and yet. Already, we can use it. For example, I've already done my homework. That is like in Spanish when you say, when you, we, we, we say, yo ya lo hice, yo ya lo, yo ya compré, yo ya lo he terminado. Es una acción que acabamos de hacer. O que hicimos en un momento atrás. She just gone to school. She just gone to a school. Ella se acaba de ir. Se acaba de ir a la escuela. Ok. Already es una acción que usted realizó antes de lo esperado. Y just es una acción que acaba de realizar. Que se acaba de ir. Acaba de terminar. Ella acaba de comer. She, she just eaten. Okay, already es una acción que fue realizado antes de lo esperado. Y just es una acción que acabamos de realizar. 
Also, we have yet. Yet, it is used either in affirmative or question. That is like in Spanish, like aún. Aún no he terminado. I haven't finished yet. Yet, eh, ya terminaste o ya, sí, eh, ya le llamaste o ella ha llamado. Has she phoned yet? Okay, esa palabra yet significa aún y puede ser utilizado en pregunta o negación. Ok, um, present perfect. After have or has. ¿Cuál, ¿Cuál es la posición de esas tres palabras? Por ejemplo, just irá después de have or has. Already irá después del auxiliar have or has. O sea que esas dos palabras, already, just, and just, eh, van situadas en medio de el auxiliar have or has y el participio del verbo. Y el yet usualmente va al final. Ok, al final. For example, she has done the washing. I've already brushed my teeth. One more time. She has done the washing. I've already brushed my teeth. Mark just had a shower. Has Peter set up yet? Okay, como, pueden darse, como pueden leer en la, pregunta, en la respuesta de la número uno. Aquí hay un apóstrofe. Marks. Esa es la contracción de has. Has. Has just. Or Marks just had. And that's the end of the review. Is there any question related with the present perfect or the word just already or yet? Is there any question? No, teacher. All right. No. No? Okay, may I continue? Yes. Good. Well, um... Okay. So tell me the elements to make sentences in present perfect. Give me the formula. What are the elements that we need to follow? Or what is the order if it is affirmative? Affirmative subject. Subject. Auxiliary. Um, Auxiliary, verb. which one? Either. Is. I. Either. Either. Ya sea. Either. Oh. Are you with they? Okay. Or. We use subject. Uh -huh. ha, have. Have or. Has. Has plus plus a uh, verb and the past participle. The past participle. The past participle the past of the verb. Mm -hmm. Okay. For example, here don't answer yet. Here you have three sentences. Tell me which one which one is the correct one. They have planted a tree. They have have plants planted a tree. Planted. A tree. Excellent. What about this? They have sold lemonade. Lemonade. They they are selling. They are selling now, present perfect. No, no present they, perfect. Have, they have, have they sold, sold lemonade. Mm -hmm. Very good. They have sold lemonade.
she has cold. cold. The bag. The bag. The bag. I'm sorry. She has called the bus. She has she has she called, have called the bus. The bus. She has caught the bus. It has, has rested it for, has an rest hour. for an hour. She, she has, has eaten the apple. The, the apple. She has what? She has eat the, pop, the, the apple. apple. She has eat the apple. This one? She has them. Yes. yes. Are you she sure? Has an Aiden. No, she has an she has an Aiden. 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 The past participle of the verb. This is infinitive. Mom has received received a letter. Uh, this or this? The last one. The last one, this one. Yes. Mom has received a letter. Good. The teacher has left. The teacher. Has left. left or left. Excellent. School. I think this is tricky. Has begun. Begun. I'm sorry. Has begun. The begun. school of school has begun. Has, has begun. begun. This one. Second. No. Second. This one. Yes. Begun. 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 She's gone to bed. Or she's gone to bed. Sorry, I'm sorry. She has gone to bed. She's went. I'm sorry, I can't hear you. Hello. Gone to bed. The last she's got she's got she has gone yes. to bed. She's gone. Mm -hmm. He has rain. He has rain. 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 Rain.
they have painted the fence? They have what? Painted. 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 The fence. Painted. Yes, thank this you. This one? Yes. Yes. Excellent. And Stephanie. Excellent. Okay. Time to practice. I'm still loving you. Hold on. Teacher, disculpe que lo que vamos a hacer que se me cayó la me sacó de la reunión. Por el momento, tranquila. Ya le voy a compartir el link. Teacher. Disculpe, ¿qué es lo que se va a hacer de los verbos? Eh, permítame, ya lo voy a compartir perfecto. la actividad. Paciencia, okay, le voy a compartir el link. Ah, ok, sí, gracias. I'm still learning. Ok, there you go. Here you have the link. And we're going to practice. Twelve players. May I start now? Yes. Okay, there you go.
Well, uh, top five, Miss, Miss Jessica, Miss Concepcion, Miss Karen, Miss Sandra, Mr. Guillermo, the winner. Excellent job. Okay. So here we have, for example, Lindsay has not been to France. Uh, have you finished your homework? They are gone to rock concert or Dave, Dave. This one, Dave. Okay. Um, have you been to Japan? We have never eaten. Andrea has forgotten her umbrella. Has the sun come up? The children have found we always been a vegetarian for three years. I haven't worked since last December. I have Broken. Excellent job. Very good. I guess we we have still time for another for another one. Okay, I'm gonna share another link. Okay, the purpose of this activity is that we remember the use of um the present perfect. That is an structure that we need to remember.
O da. Mm, okay. This test will be a little bit tricky, but you will like it. Here you have. Teacher, can I pide código? El código de juego no válido. Eh, close it and try again. Okay. I'm gonna leave the link again. Okay, let's start.
All right, this time was much better. Very good. Excellent, very good. Thank you very much for your participation. And here we go. For example, top five, Miss Sandra, Miss Yvonne, Mr. Guillermo, Miss Jessica, and the winner, Miss Karen. Very good. Miss Jessica and Miss Karen has a 100, but Miss Karen was faster. Okay, very good. Okay, thank you very much for your participation. Now I need to take the attendance list. So do you mind turning on your computer, please? Your, your computer, your camera, your camera, please. Uh, as usual, when you listen your name, when you listen to your name, say hi or present as you feel more comfortable. And let's start. Uh, Miss Hernandez Otelo, Maribel Ramos, Calderón de López, Present teacher. Alvarado de Benavides. Present. Guerrero Molina. Present teacher. López González. Present teacher. Rugamas Melara. Present. Santana González. España Marroquín. España. I'm here, teacher. Eh, Alvarado Mejía. Present. Eh, León Rivera. Present teacher. Thank you. Castaneda Velasco. Romero Ayala. Present teacher. Rosibel Hernández. Present teacher. Molina de García. Present. López de Cabrera. All right. Well, eh, let's stop right Present here. Present teacher. Thank you. Let's stop right here the class. I appreciate your help, your participation through this class. Tomorrow we're going to have class number 10 and we're going to be almost in the middle of the course. So God bless you. Okay. Good night and see you tomorrow. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.